Marta Jeska of Poland, Polish indoor champion, receiving a huge round of applause. Bartoletta is the former world long jump champion outdoors. Veronica Campbell Brown defending IWF world champion. Chanel Proctor and Gillen record holder at high jump indoors and out. And Azine Okpareva of Norway. This particular heat is full of stars. Cheska, Bartoletta, Campbell Brown, Proctor, Okparebo, Owusu, Ajipong, and Samuels of the Netherlands, nearest the camera. Owusu, Ajipong, 7.23, lifetime best this season. But compare that to Veronica Campbell Brown at seven seconds dead. And she would be some yards back. The <laughs> Campbell Brown not away too well. Bartoletta is going well. And Operabo. Operabo and Bartoletta got that. Operabo in second place. I think uh, Veronica Campbell-Brown may have got third, but she certainly didn't have the start. That was surprising, Colin. You know, I was wondering, Paul, what her racing was going to be like when she'd been out for so long. It's important that you get into the groove of competition as soon as you possibly can. But, of course, when you're returning from the troubles that Veronica Campbell-Brown has had, then the racing is going to be lacking, and it certainly showed here. It doesn't even matter how good you are as a champion, what you can do, you still need to get into this competition mode to prove to yourself that you're there or thereabouts. And when you look at the winning time, it's a long, long way off what Veronica Campbell-Brown could achieve at a height of 7 flat. That winning time was 7-1-3. But it was a good performance. It was a good victory by the American. It's nice to see that some of these athletes from the U.S. are, are delivering at the world stage. We know what they do over in the U.S.A. and sometimes we're slightly... Slightly difficult when they come to Europe to reproduce those performances, but uh, certainly here in the world indoors, we've been seeing some of those very good indeed. Tiana Bartoletta winning that one 7.13, Okpak Okparibo 7.19, and first race back for Veronica Campbell Brown looking a little bit rusty there. Season's best though, 7.22. Let's get a reaction to that race. Veronica back on the world stage how was it for you i'm happy to be back and uh i do thank god for that first run it's been a long time since i compete so i'm grateful that i advanced to the semi-finals i suppose that's the key for you to get back into action get that that rustiness out of your legs in a, in a competitive arena you could say so but i'm grateful to be here and just taking it one round at the time was the overriding emotion a sense of relief or delight that you were back today what was it i was born to run track and field so i'm happy to be to be here doing what i was born to do good to see you back thank you